Well, this year's historic snowpack has all our rivers and creeks flowing higher and faster than usual, including a creek in southern Utah that's typically a muddy hiking trail. Fox 13 News reporter Jenna Bree takes us to Emory County, where people are taking advantage of a rare phenomenon. When it comes to Utah's most magnificent natural wonders, not everyone knows about the Muddy Creek. The canyon's amazing. It's really scenic. Uh, the chute is just breathtaking. 300-foot walls, water from wall to wall. But this wall-to-wall -wall water is not usually there. On drought years, it can actually dry up and go completely dry. Jaden Mead um, says the Muddy River flows once a year for about a week during the spring runoff few people are able to float the whole thing. Usually by the time they hear that it's floatable and they put together a trip, it's no longer floatable. And this year, um, it has been. The shoot of the muddy trip is 15 miles long, and it takes an estimated more than seven hours to float. Because of hazards like trees, rocks, and flooding, the BLM recommends only experienced paddlers try it. There was a tree that had fallen across the whole creek, and both of us got flipped on the tree, and. She went under it and I went over it. <laughs> <laughs> Matt Pesha and Shelby yeah. Carter had never paddled down the muddy creek before. We walked it actually and it was truly muddy. It was mud up to, you know, knee deep sometimes. And so that made me wonder what it would be like to, to do it with a raft. The muddy creek has been flowing for weeks already. And the BLM guesses it could be full of water until July. It's really nice to see some of these things, some of the ephemeral washes flowing. It's just been kind of a different year. Get to see a, a different side of the place. With more people having the window of opportunity to float the muddy, Mead hopes visitors remember to pack in, pack out, and leave no trace. Definitely a very unique and remote place. And I, I hope we can keep it that way. In Emory County, Jenna Bree, Fox 13 News, Utah.